this is once again Vic of EU Market Biz and in this video I am going to share with you news updates brought to you by preferred currency news okay so without further ado let's begin okay so uh, here's the website where we got our news updates today okay so all right so there's a lot of articles here already and if you're bored and if you want to read the latest news updates today okay visit PCN now today all right so all you have to do is just to click this one right and if you are, are finding for a specific um, token um, especially EOS Ethereum Litecoin or, and Bitcoin just click this one or this uh, button so that we, so that the news will fil be filtered to EOS only, right? So like this one. Okay, so let's see. And then you're going to choose uh, here. Okay. So that's PCN today. So let's start our news update. All right. So 26 French companies, five banks complete blockchain-based KYC trial based on R3's cord. Okay, so 26 French companies and five major banks have completed a Know Your Customer or KYC test based on blockchain, according to a press release by the entrant firm RCI Bank and Services released December 3. Okay, so RCI Bank and Services, a French automotive financing and insurance firm, unveiled Details of a customer knowledge focused blockchain solution trialed in partnership with Blockchain Consortium R3. So, according to um, a press release, uh, the proof of concept test has been conducted in cooperation with the association Francais des um, Tresores Enterprise or AFTE or a local network of treasury and finance professionals. As revealed by a participant of the test, RCI Bank and Services, which is also a member of the R3 Consortium, trial participants were able to implement KYC requests within a shared network, with banks having to request access to data and enterprise clients base, uh, able to approve and revoke access. With all the data rec recorded on the blockchain, so R3 scored a KYC solution test. Reportedly involved five French banks, including the financial conglomerate BNP Paribas and Société Générale. The trial has also featured companies specializing in various fields, such as insurance, consulting the automotive and food industries and retail including such firms as Alliance France Insurance Company and Natixis Insurance All right. so that is the first update today so this is very good news as more and more companies are embracing the blockchain technology today okay so right mm -hmm. So let's go to the next topic. So life's hard for crypto users who don't speak English, but it might be about to get easier. So this is very nice. All right. So the crypto markets have been something of a roller coaster ride recently. With the price of Bitcoin recently tumbling to its lowest level since October 2018. But despite the doom and gloom, Enthusiasm and optimism about cryptocurrency's potential remain. So much so uh, that one expert predicts Bitcoin will rally back to 15,000 by the end of the year. Oh, so this is great. So I hope that happens. One thing that has stood in the way of crypto's growth as a dominant worldwide force is how it has struggled to transcend cultural and linguistic buyers in certain countries true so according to Bistranex, a crypto trading platform this is the case in vietnam where it says the levels of innovation seen in blockchain technology are unmatched with real capacity of vietnam's market so the company says 
Vietnam is an emerging market for Bitcoin in Southeast Asia and it plans to capitalize on this by offering an innovative exchange that provides first-class analytical tools on top-tier technical security with a four-step KYC protocol protecting investors, right? So optimized for traders in Vietnam to meet market demand. Biztronex offers cutting-edge tools including chart Q or chart IQ, an advanced HTML5 charting system that delivers ultimate control and quick comprehension for traders looking to get a head start in the market. Okay, so broadening crypto's horizons. So as well as being an exchange with global ambitions, Bistronex says it wants to stand out from the crowd by tailoring its service to Vietnamese speakers, enabling them to access technical support and financial services in a language they understand. Underlining the platform's ambitions to expand internationally, an array of other languages are also available, with Russian, English, Portuguese, Chinese, Turkish, and Korean among them. Okay, so the company claims to offer the most liquid order book in the world, a place where Bitcoin, Ethereum, Ripple, Litecoin, EOS, and other digital assets can be exchanged. Mr. Nex says it also values suggestions from its community and is prepared to list new assets if they gain a considerable amount of support from users, right? So in addition to features that expert crypto users have come to expect from exchanges, such as cold storage and investment funds, the platform has created what it describes as a social network of ICOs. Here, each ICO taking place in Bistronex is given its own profile, which enables the com community to receive direct updates and get in touch with startups if they have questions. So the ecosystem is also geared towards helping inexperienced users become more accustomed to crypto trading by enabling them to benefit from the expertise and knowledge base of experienced markets practitioners. For time for users who have a good understanding about cryptocurrency but lack the time to research in the market, an auto trade tool will enable them to automatically emulate top traders who are rated based on their past performance. So explaining its motivations in a blog post, the Bistronex team wrote, the world needs a next generation cryptocurrency exchange which is innovative, fast, and easy to use and understand. The company has a multiple pla uh, multi-platform mentality and wants its exchange to be available in every screen. In time, Bistronex says users will be able to download optimized versions of its software for Mac and Windows computers, as well as smartphones running iOS and Android. Okay. So if you want to continue further reading, um, here's the update. But to make it short, um. This is very very good news since you know a lot of people are interested in cryptocurrency but doesn't know how to speak in English so or doesn't know or doesn't understand how to speak uh, understand English so it's really really hard for them so this is the right solution for them okay so business all right so the next one is uh, I'm going to share you this coin. So this is called this token is token right there. So it's called DAP coin and it's ranked 626 in core market coin market cap. And here's its price, its market cap, its volume in 24 hour period, its circulating supply, its total supply. Okay, and you can get this um, token at these exchanges. All right. So this token is decentralized autonomous vehicles. Right, so it's the coin of transportation. So let's go to their website. Here it is. It's coin of the transportation, blockchain-based transportation protocol, enabling a decentralized peer-to-peer -peer global transportation network. So it's a token that focuses on a technology about drones, about robots, about see. Okay. So here's the technology. 
right? So the centralized discovery, communication protocol, and trust desk operation tools, right? So, um, so this is their uh, expectation to, of blockchain in the future. See, where drones will be the one who will be delivering uh, our packages. See, okay, guys. So DAB token. So guys, I think that's it. So. Guys, before I go, I just want to say that I am not a financial advisor. And I think I say here is not a recommendation for you to buy and sell crypto. So you must always do your own research before deciding for yourself, right? So guys, um, keep note of PC and out today and Dev coin, right? So keep note of it, Dev coin. I know you'll love this one. So if you want to explore further the project, um, I've already made videos about this token so please watch it in my previous videos for now uh, keep note of this one and include DAO token in your research list okay so I think that's it and guys um, this has been Vic once again bringing you the latest news on cryptocurrencies and the latest updates on crypto related articles right so once again um, this has been Vic signing off bye bye